Hey everyone, it's Amy. Welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to make these peanut butter banana cupcakes. It's just a banana cupcake base filled with a banana curd and topped off with a peanut butter buttercream frosting. So let's get started with the banana cupcake recipe. So to one and a half cups of all-purpose flour, you're going to add a teaspoon of baking powder, three quarters of a teaspoon of baking soda, and a quarter teaspoon of salt. Just give that a quick whisk and set that aside. Now in a separate large bowl, you're gonna add two ripe bananas. Now you can use a fork or a potato masher, but I decided to just use my mixer to make it all smooth and blended. Now you can add half a cup of white sugar and a quarter cup of brown sugar, along with a teaspoon of vanilla extract and six tablespoons of melted butter. Give this a quick mix until well combined. And then you want to add two eggs and mix, mix, mix. Now we can start adding our dry ingredients and I just like to do this half at a time. Once the first half is blended in, you can add the rest and mix well until combined. I always like to use a spatula to give this a last mix just to make sure that no chunks of butter or dry ingredients are left behind. Now you can scoop your batter into your cupcake liners and obviously I'm using an ice cream scoop as always just to make things a bit easier. And you want to bake these off at 350 Fahrenheit or 180 Celsius for about 18 to 20 minutes. In the meantime we can make the banana curd filling. In a saucepan, you want to add two ripe bananas, along with two eggs, a quarter cup of sugar, and about a tablespoon of lemon juice just to keep the bananas from browning too much. And here I'm using the mixer just to blend this well. You can also use an immersion blender if you have one. Now you want to continuously stir this mixture over medium heat to make sure that the eggs don't scramble. As you keep stirring, it should get thicker and thicker. And once it's like this, you can remove it from the heat. And then you can add two tablespoons of butter. And mix that in until it's completely melted. And you can transfer this mixture into a shallow dish and spread it out with a spatula. And you want to cover it with plastic wrap, make sure that it's actually touching the surface so a skin does not form. And let this cool in the fridge for about an hour or two. Now we can move on to making the peanut butter buttercream frosting. So in a large bowl you want to add 6 tablespoons of softened unsalted butter along with 3 quarters of a cup of creamy peanut butter. Give this a beat on high speed until it is nice and light and fluffy. Now you can add a cup of powdered sugar to this and mix this well. Don't forget to give your bowl a scrape just to make sure that powdered sugar and butter isn't left unmixed. Now we can add about three tablespoons of whipping cream just to thin this out. You can also use milk and you can add more or less depending on the consistency of your buttercream at this point. Once that's all ready, you can transfer it to a pastry bag. Once your cupcakes are completely cold, you can use a cupcake core or even an apple core to core out the center of the cupcakes. And you can fill it with that banana curd filling and just plop the top right back on. Then you can pipe the frosting right on top.
and finish it off with a banana slice. And that's it, here are your finished peanut butter banana cupcakes. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and I'll see you guys next time. Bye everyone.